Met this nice young lady here, and um, she's got a pretty interesting story. And of course, she's very pretty, so that always helps the channel. But I uh, wanted to talk with her a little bit, trying to find out what her story is and why she's here and things. So um, I'll turn it over to her now. Would you like to introduce myself? No. <laughs> <laughs> no. First, what's your name? First name only? Yes, my name's Victoria. Victoria. Really? And tell me, uh, what brought you to Nicaragua? Well, uh, I was supposed to travel and volunteer in Costa Rica for a few months, uh, but I couldn't find anything. I've been searching since January, but it seems like everyone wants to volunteer there. So uh, I started looking for other countries, Panama and Nicaragua, uh, and I ended up in Nicaragua, and now I'm volunteering here for six weeks in a hostel. Wow. And, yeah. you, and tell everyone where you're from again? Yes, I'm from Belgium. And Belgium, and where else? Where else? My ethnicity? No, you said you spent some time in California. Oh, right. Yeah, so I'm from Belgium. I did a gap year in Northern California. Really liked it. So in college, I went for another semester in Chicago. I did an internship in Amsterdam, and now I'm traveling around Central America. How'd you like Amsterdam? It's nice. It's a bit like uh, the Belgian culture, I suppose. They're a little bit more open-minded. Right? Did you have an opportunity when you were in Amsterdam to try out any of the medical... Uh... Oh, no, not really into that. Also, I had to write my thesis, so uh, I had to be very focused. Ah, uh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I understand. But as you know, that you hear Amsterdam, there's only basically one thing associated with it. Or at least it used to be. It may have changed now. No, Amsterdam is really nice. A lot of cultures there. People are very open-minded and nice. So I really like my time spending there. Very expensive, though, to rent a house. But... Oh, really? Yeah. 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 Oh. Anyway, well, what's the game plan for the future in Nicaragua? The future? So I'm here until May of Juan del Sur. Uh, after that, I might do a surf camp. I'm also here to learn how to surf. So it's a perfect place. And then I'll probably go to El Transito and Popoyo, another few cities. And then it will be time for me to go back to Belgium. So I'll be, yeah, mid-June I'm leaving. And then I'll work as a lifeguard in the summer. I'm just curious, how did you find, I mean, how did you find San Juan of all the places in the world? How did you find San Juan del Sur? Um, I think I was just doing some research work of all the must visit uh, places here in Nicaragua. And also since I'm uh, into surfing and want to learn how to surf, I searched, you know, for beach towns. And San Juan del Sur was like highly recommended on every blog. Have you done surfing here? Yes. Oh, uh, you're a California kind of part-time gal. You gotta be doing some surfing. Are you good yes. at it? Um, Don't be modest. <laughs> no, I'm, I'm a beginner, but I'm getting there. I'm almost every day in the water, so I can feel myself improving, but I, I'm not confident to say that I'm a good surfer. Well, I mean, it's not like if I got on a board, I'm gonna sink, but the uh, you, you've got a night nice, lightweight body and you're young, so, and everybody's gotta start somewhere. So right. it's, it's not like you're starting here with 20 foot waves. You got pretty decent ways that you can start with and learn with so exactly. it's a good starting point and once you get it you can do it all over the world I'm sure I'm sure you're not done traveling when it comes here you sound like a very traveled young lady yes. and uh, you're yes. just beginning your travels so yeah exactly well in June I'll be broke so I just have to go home to work a bit and after that we'll see where uh, where where it all ends yeah. yeah because it may never end hopefully not but hopefully not. well gosh i certainly enjoy meeting you i certainly appreciate you taking the time to do my interview Absolutely. and uh, you as well. i hope to see you again kicking around town if um you know i hope you don't have any more negative experiences and you know but anyway yes bye, bye. for now safe bye. travels hey folks i really need your help Please, I've just started the channel and really need you to do me a big solid in growing it and getting you the content you need, like, or enjoy. You know the drill. Please hit subscribe, like, share, and hit the bell for the newest weekly content. And lastly, please comment below and let me know how I'm doing. You know, what needs to be improved, um, any ideas you have for more videos, what you like, what you didn't like, let me know so I can get some feedback and kind of crank things up a bit. All right. Hopefully we'll get some new videos very soon and um, get better as we go. Thanks and look forward to your help.